Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This is your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. I want to give a shout out to Notification Gang, Key Talk Gang, even though they're really the same thing for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go ahead and like the video and hit the notification bell so you get a notification every single time I drop a video. Anyways. So one of the co-founders of YSL, a guy that goes by the name of YSL Mundo, he's pretty much came out and gave his input on, you know, the words that Gunner's been saying. You know, Gunner pretty much came out and said Gunner's back. Uh, pretty much came out and said that YSL is only one YSL. There ain't no divide, no splitting up at all. Pretty much everything is peaches and cream. And of course, uh, Free Yak Gotti and Free Young Thug as well. Now you know. YSL Mundo pretty much came out to let everybody know that he is G-U-N-N-A gonna tell her free can't rock with gonna cause gonna tell on me man you know he also made it clear that anybody that was talking about you know gonna while he was actually locked up pretty much calling them rats and stuff like that that if any of y'all inside of the comment section and all of y'all inside of the likes make sure when it's all said and done y'all make sure y'all stay on that side you know what I'm talking about cause y'all got ears just like he got ears you know what I'm talking about y'all heard what he heard y'all saw what he saw so pretty much you know it's kind of like a civil war within the whole YSL right now uh, and it's kind of like Gunna versus everybody. And, and, and there is a potential that it, more people will be in this position as well. Actually, you know, they unfollow uh, Young Slime Life Shawty, uh, Slime Life Shawty, whatever his name is. Y'all know uh, they unfollowed him as well. Uh, and then, of course, even Young Thug's sister, the other sister, not just the Dolly White Lady, the other sister actually unfollowed Gunna as well. So, like I said, you can kind of see which direction they're moving towards anyways. Here's the words directly from the YSL co-founder. You know what I'm saying? But it posting what he posting like, how can you think you back real after what you did, what you did? Then everybody on that mother liking it, posting, coming, but y'all was just talking about, buddy. Y'all was just talking about he did that in the third. He done read it and all that did that in the third. Now y'all up on his picture. Eating a Come on, man. Make sure y'all stay on that side now. Gonna go doing all that. Make sure y'all stay over there with buddy. And I ain't got nothing against so I f with buddy, but he did what he did. Yeah, like I was saying though, bro. True, bro. Y'all got the same eyes and ears I did, bro. You feel what I'm saying? And, and but and but I really feel like bro you, you you really got some type of nerve, baby boy. You really got some nerve, bro, to be on that mother talking about free bro after they did what they did, bro. You should have been saying that, bro. You was you should have had that type of mindset while you was in there, baby boy. You already know. It sounds like YSL Mundo wanted the uh you know the yes ma'am viral video to go like this. <clears throat> And Ghana, um, is YSL a criminal organization and does it need to be banned? <laughs> Yana, I just, I just want to say one thing, well, a couple of things about that question you just asked. Uh, for one, Yana, I'm pushing P forever. Uh, free all the slimes and, uh, and free thug as well. And the crowd goes, <gasps> And the judge goes, order in the court, order in the court. I'm going to give you one more chance, little gunner son. Is YSL a criminal organization and does YSL needs to be disbanded? <sighs> gunner thinks to himself a couple seconds. Your Honor, like I said before, I'm pushing peas. I'm not pushing please. I would never turn on the guys. Do whatever you're going to do. Y'all got the same I already know. Like I always say, the final thought about all this will be up to y'all. Do y'all think that YSL is being way too hard on Gunna? Or do y'all feel like you know the people that's treating Gunna the way they're treating him should be treating him that way? Uh, because he didn't stand on business or stand tall for the gang gang or hola hola hola, not the gang gang the record label because they're saying that why it sells a record label they just so happen to possibly have a couple bodies under the belt i mean yeah, you know it just so happened allegedly 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 anyways let me know some coming down below let me know what you think about this entire deal i'm out